There are countries in the world that people want to visit, and countries people don't want to visit. I have don't know why there's no videos on the least visited countries in the world. Of course, this has nothing to do with movies or or Pokemon or anything else that is much more interesting. But these are the every country in the world. Who visits these countries the most or the least? Number one, the, we'll be going to wind one country by one country, okay? France, um, for some reason, has 80 million people visiting it. Um, I don't know why people choose France over every other country um, in the world. Spain, uh, 75 million people. America, 76 million people. So these, are under, these guys are understandable. These are the most famous countries in the world. China, a lot of people go to China. Turkey. 40 million people, Italy, 52 million people, um, Germany, 45 million people, and the UK, 45 million people, um, Thailand, 42 million people, Japan, 24 million people, but then let's go to the countries that no one visits, okay, these are countries that nobody wants to go to. What is the first country we want to go over? Iran. Iran is nowhere compared to these other countries, 4 million people. 5 million people a year, 4 to 5 million people a year visit Iran, which people still go here. Probably people from, you know, these countries here, um, because I don't think anyone from America is really going to want to visit Iran. And Syria, I don't know where that status from, because I think no one visits Syria. Visit Syria. I don't think 8 million people really visit Syria. Um, 80 million people a year visit Saudi Arabia. That's actually pretty impressive because I thought the country has a really bad government. Um, Yemen. 1 million people still visit Yemen a year despite being a really terrible place to go to. Uh, Somalia. Then there's these countries. These countries have no data. Somalia, South Sudan, this country, Afghanistan, and North Korea all have no data. So we don't have to talk about those countries. Um, well, Asia has 41 million visitors, and that's surprising, um, probably people from Asia. Indonesia has 11 million visitors in contrast, for some reason, for Asia, despite being bigger. And no one visits the Philippines. I wonder why. Um, for, despite the people on YouTube saying, oh, we visit the Philippines, it's such a great place. No one really comes here. Same thing with Australia. And when we go to Australia and the Philippines, despite there being all these dangerous and venomous animals in Australia, Nobody goes to New Zealand, okay? No one, no one goes to New Zealand, okay? This is this an unspoken rule why no one goes to New Zealand, okay? This is no one likes this place, you know. And more people go to Australia than Brazil. I can understand why Brazil is very humid. It's very uh, annoying. Um, no one wants to go to a place that's super humid every second of the day. Uh, Bolivia, however, nobody goes to Bolivia. 959,000 people go to Bolivia a year. Bolivia is like the country that no one wants to be, okay? Bolivia is a country that no one wants to be, okay? Paraguay. More people go to Paraguay than Bolivia. That can tell you something about Bolivia, okay? And of course, no one goes to Venezuela, but if you look at what's happening in Venezuela, you can understand why no one goes here. Oh, yeah, and also, more people go to Ecuador than, Bo than Bolivia, um, and more people go to Uruguay. Than Bolivia as well. That can tell you how unpopular this country is. Nobody likes this country. And definitely more people go to Mexico than all of South America probably combined. Um, Guatemala has 1.5 million people going to it, and Honduras has less people than Bolivia. Uh, Nicaragua, Costa Rica, 2.1.9 million. Cuba has 3.9 million visitors. But then you go to Africa. These countries, Africa is the bane of people not wanting to go here. Okay, Africa is kind of like the continent that is the one kid on the block that always gets ignored, but has still a few friends. Okay, there are the countries that people do go to, like Morocco, Algeria. Let's 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 people go to Algeria than Australia, Tunisia. Um. Libya has none. And Egypt has 5 million. And also goes to Central Asia. No one goes here either um, because it's unstable. M more people go to Kyrgyzstan than Tajikistan and Kazakhstan. 
No, no, actually, both people go to Kazakhstan, and no one goes to Mongolia because it's basically desert. No one wants to go to the desert, okay? Then Sudan, no one goes here because it's a giant desert. Uh, same thing with Namibia. Actually, both people go to Namibia than Sudan. Um, Botswana. Do not know why, but two million people a year go to Zimbabwe. Both people go to Zimbabwe than Paraguay. And both people go to Zimbabwe than Bosnia and Herzegovina, which is one of the least visited countries in Europe. No one really wants to go here in general to the Balkans, because it's just not a good place to go to. And the least visited country in Europe is Moldova, because nobody likes this place. Moldova is kind of like that one guy in Europe that this, everybody just wants to avoid. He's just not a good guy. Same thing with um, Republic of Congo. Also, Gabon has nobody either, and Equatorial Guinea. Nobody goes here. It says no people go. Nobody really goes here. It's zero people. Um, Guinea. Too many. Some of these countries are just don't even have. Let's say, Ivory Coast literally is civ. So, two one point eight million people go to the civ country. Okay. Two million people go. One point eight million people go to the country that's called civ. Maui. No one goes here because Maui is just a giant desert. Anyways, it's only like one spot you can really go to. Burkina Faso. Literally, someone from Montana just called me. I don't go to Montana. I have no connections with Montana. No one goes to these countries here: Benin, Togo, Ghana. Oh, uh, I, 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 more people visit Bolivia than Ghana. I'll explain how Bolivia, no, Bolivia is under is this place is more undesirable than Bolivia. Nobody goes to Nigeria. That's for sure. Even the country that is very friendly towards um tourists, Kenya. Only one point two million people go to Kenya, yeah. Um Tanzania. No one goes here either. Um Zim Zav actually, these countries do pretty well in tourism compared to the rest of Africa. Look at Congo. 86 million people, but only less, than, less people than the population of... Okay, which country has a really old population? What people than the population of Guyana go to the De Democratic Republic of the Congo? Despite having more people than Germany, I think. Is there more people in Germany? Let's see. Germany has 83 million. Yeah, it has more people than Germany, but... Less people than the population of Bhutan, another comparison, go here. Oh yeah, another country that no one goes to is a surprise is Haiti, because, you know, I'm just people go here, because people, people disappear here all the time, Dominican Republic. Um, wait, Puerto Rico actually, three million people go to Puerto Rico, yeah. That's way more than, people always complain about Puerto Rico being poor, but then you have Democratic Republic Congo and nobody goes here because... No, it's Uganda. More people go to Uganda. I won't be surprised if 2018, the Ugandan, um, I think this was supposed to be made in 2017, because I think Ugandan tourism went up by like 80% because of Ugandan knuckles. Because people want to go here to see the Ugandan knuckles that they will never find. Ethiopia, no one goes here for some reason. Um, probably because it's landlocked, because you have to take a plane now. Um, I know it's just really hard to take a plane to Ethiopia, but you know, it's, and it's sad. Nobody goes to a country called sad. People always talk about sads all the time, but then you have a country called sad and no one goes to it. I think this country needs more attention. It's really called sad, okay? Uh, give this country more attention. Um, neither. No one goes here. Um, Probably because it's just a giant desert, and no one wants to go to a giant desert. Same thing with this country, because most of this country is like a giant desert. But for some of the 23 million people are still mad to live here. I, I wonder who, what type of people they are. They're probably these city people who live on these markets on a few bro, uh, I don't know, lives in these city markets in the middle of the desert. Um, that's probably Niger in a nutshell. Um, same thing with Chad and Sudan. Um. There's probably like all these city people living in the sour that are just waiting, just waiting for someone to give them water and stuff. And yeah, I'm talking about those people. For some reason, no one goes to Kuwait. I think these numbers are false because I think a lot of people do go to Kuwait. Or it's probably that's a country that is oversoured by Saudi Arabia, United Arab Emirates, and Qatar. 
Um, Okay, if now let's go see what the real most least visited country. Guinea Bissau. Guinea, what's that? What was Guinea Bissau? Okay, what was that? That's like in the middle of nowhere. No wonder I no one visits Guinea Bissau. No, it's in the middle of nowhere in Africa. That's the reason why no one visits this country, because it's like in the middle of nowhere, okay? Oh yeah, we're in the middle of nowhere. Come visit us. You know, you know, it's visit our country. No one, it's in the middle of nowhere, and literally nobody knows us. We exist. Central African Republic. No one visits this country either. Um, no one visits this country, but it's it's not a country that people get. Well, why? Why this country exists? It, it, and like, like if you see the Democratic Republic of the Congo, you, no one, no one visits this country. Um. Let's see what countries visit got visited more than Democratic Republic of Congo. No one goes bingo that's Well Bingo Das already has enough people already. <laughs> this, this is probably the reason why no one visits Bingo Das. They has enough people already. They, they don't want anyone coming down to add more stuff there. Um more people visit the Cayman Islands, which had 64,000 people than the uh, Democratic Republic of Congo. Oh yeah, do you know that more people visit Wazofo, another unknown country in Africa than Democratic Republic? And more people visit the United States Virgin Islands. More people visit a country called the Virgin Islands, Liechtenstein. More people visit there. A country adopted the where, where was Liechtenstein? Uh, in Nepal, more people visit there, more people visit, visit Bosnia. But at least, Democratic Republic of Congo is a bad over um, Moldova, which literally no one visits Moldova. Um, and which literally no one visits Moldova because, you know, Moldova is a country that nobody wants to go to because it's so terrible. Um, you know, I guess Congo has something of, had, at least they can boast about being better than Moldova. But yeah, but when you're being outclassed by Mongolia, which is basically a giant desert, Congo, you have to be doing better. <laughs> there must be seriously something wrong with your country if you're being beaten by Mongolia. Um, and also the other Congo no one goes to, but maybe because people got confused with this Congo and they say, okay, we're not going to this place because it's same place, same name. Um, you know they have two, 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 two totally entirely different flags. Uh, you know. Well, and also you're also being beat by Namibia, which is another giant desert. Um, cause like down here is like a giant desert. Um, so it's into like Botswana, South Africa, not, and a bit into Angola. Oh yeah, you know your country's bad when it's being outclassed by Bosnia and Herzegovina. A country that's practically ungovernable because of its ethnic divisions. That's basically it. Goodbye.